What is up guys and this is the second part of the video with the replaced controller so I think in previous video you saw how I replaced controllers that can run only up to 20 kilometers per hour and now I can run it 32 kilometers per hour. What I want to show you is a brief review of the app here so basically as you see I just start to connect and then it's uh, shown me the 9 bot kick scooter F2 Pro but this is F2 Plus so it's recognized like this and now I'm connecting it to my phone and bending with my, okay, asking to click. Device pair successfully, okay. Now it's asking me to bend with my email address. Okay, it's done. So actually it's showing us exactly new scooter. Now it's suggesting me some safety, how to ride it safely and blah, blah, blah. So finally I have it. That's my scooter with a new controller. So my previous controller showed as another scooter. Now I have two of them, but actually only one. Uh, what it shows me is the dashboard. So ride duration, some voltage is normal, power off, power on. Settings, so as you see, finally cruise mode is here. Energy recovery, same, just cruise mode, edit. I think if you're in Germany or in Europe countries or actually in any countries except the United States, you will you will not have the cruise mode. And when you replace your controller, finally the cruise mode arrives. So you have two options to enable it by pressing direction indicator switch for three seconds. And the second option is enabled by holding a throttle for five seconds. So we can try it now. I just uh, click on it, then just let's start okay firstly we need to start from zero okay here we have the start speed so i set it to zero kilometers so i can start it from zero then okay let's go 32 i hold it for five seconds one two three four five as you see you have indicator of the cruise mode here now it's going to 32 and when you just click it, it just stops. So cruise mode works well. Actually, that's why we do doing it. Also cruise mode, star speed can be changed. That is also not available in the regular app. Uh, tracking control function, I think this one is available. Let's keep it like this. Let's go all the settings one by one. Uh, medium energy recovery, I prefer. Walk mode, no need. Charge and limit, although no need to change. Star speed, I prefer three kilometers per hour. System metrical or empirical, you can adjust based on your region. Custom settings for sport mode, so this is what we need. I prefer normal, you can put acceleration speed to max speed, energy save normal. And max speed is 32 kilometers per hour, that's customizable on drive, you can go up to uh, 25 kilometers, on eco is 15 kilometers, and on sport or speed mode, 32 kilometers. Also you have locking function, I don't use it, but it was available before. Direction indicator, I like to use it when you click. You have direction, you have sound of it. Okay, turn it off. Uh, and uh, abnormal alert. Device information, so that's the master control version is 1.4.10. Can be unlocked, also the new version available, I will not update it of course. Battery 1 to 1 and the Bluetooth version is uh, 3.6.6. .6. I will not touch it as for now. And it's shown that I it was activated on 9th of... Uh, so basically the first activation date of this device was on September. Currently it is... no uh, actually it's December. So... Three months ago it was activated, all the other, and total mileage is 0 0.2 kilometers, but I already spent on this scooter more than 1000 kilometers here. Actually, that's how it is. And everything's working perfectly, even with change controller, I had a short ride, working well. As you see, one day is a proud owner, just connected, can set the password, also about vehicle, some information. I don't know whether it will load, let's try it out. And this controller, uh, sir, as uh, just to remind you, I bought it from China 
and uh, I paid for it around 30 dollars or like 30 euros and currently I can write to 32 commits per hour has a cruise mode uh, and it's actually nice for its price all this function here as you see it uh, the scooter looks almost same like no changes visually with a regular one I just untouch it here unstick it let's say and glue it back nothing special from this side and it's working well so actually check my other video if you want also to have 32 kilometers per hour actually as for today that's pretty much it thank you very much for watching put the thumbs up and see you next time